Mamma Masalia, what a great pleasure to meet you again here in this uh, new situation, new mood. Uh, it, everything is new this uh, season. With uh, the great artists who realize that with you this editorial and, uh, and uh, yeah, editorial project, we can say, tell us something about uh, the guideline uh, and, uh, the, uh, and the meaning of uh, this uh, new project for Red Month. You, you know, I think Slava's work is so iconic and what he's done we, I mean, he's done a lot of amazing books, but my connection with Slava started when I found his book called The Lost Boys, and I absolutely fall in love with his work. And I said to my team, I said, I really need to speak to this guy, because <laughs> when we started with MNTS, the whole mood of it was so much Slava, and this is how we got in touch with him, and we said we're going to do something fantastic together. And it was important also for me to do it outside of the shows, outside of everything, to give Slava and his work the attention that he actually deserves. With your sex uh, when you met Guan for the first time, when he called you for, to realize something together, what did you think about uh, his brand, about the, the philosophy, the, the, the great uh, um, DNA, the strong DNA of the month. I think we have a lot in common because we're both kind of outsiders. Of uh, I'm at the outside of the art world, and Guram is kind of the outside of the fashion world. And I'm not a fashion person, but I really respect what he does, and I think it's mutual. And it was a synergy in terms of working together because it was just something that c came together very organically in a very natural way. And honestly, I have nothing but good things to say about these collaborations. Well, people, everybody say that you are an outsider, <laughs> and, and it's true. Maybe you. you you confirm me that. What do you think that uh, it means to be an outsider inside the fashion system? You know, if you take a point that is outside of this world, you can actually look at the world, see it and describe it. I think it gives you a lot of benefits because you see it from the different perspective and you can see what's right, what's wrong and what needs to be changed. And what is um, the most, the, the, the wrongest uh, thing uh, at the moment in our world, in our fashion system? By there are many, many things, but I think the main problem with the fashion industry today is they think about how to promote the brand rather than concentrating to make clothes that actually people want to wear. For me, fashion in the first place, it comes with clothes. And when I design, it's not about a show, it's not about publicity, it's actually how do we make this perfect garment and it's not just for you to buy it, that's, that's one step. But for you, for, for you, this item needs to become your favorite thing in the wardrobe. And when you don't know what to wear and you say I want to wear this, I don't know, t simple t-shirt, yes. this means this is a purpose for us. So I think important is to concentrate on the clothes you make and not on other unnecessary things. Thank you so much, thank you so much and uh, thank you for this great uh, work. Uh, surely it, it has uh, written a new chapter of uh, fashion history. Great, Perfect. great thank job, you thank much. you so much. And now we need to choose the book that you like. Oh yes, of and course. And then we're going to sign it with Slava together. Yeah, so thank you. Have you. Nice <laughs>